Like we all get to be little and you don't have to be big and grown up and have everything figured out. You just, you just get to be little. And I think that's such a, that's such a great, that's such, that's such hope for all of us, our, our families, our children, our church, our world, that we can continue to grow and, and to be transformed. Oh my gosh, that's amazing. You know, one thing we've seen in deliverance and, and also in exorcism ministry and, and have become uh, thoroughly convinced of St. Teresa of Avila said it herself, God withholds himself from no one who perseveres, mm -hmm. right? I think yeah. it's important that people listening know, and I know you can speak to it with conviction as we can, everyone who stays in the fight, like everyone, we, you've worked with thousands of people, we work with thousands of mm -hmm. people, and I can't think of a single person no matter how bad mm -hmm. they were broken, whether it be, you know, actually I don't even want to give examples that, we, that we've seen, but from things that you could, you could never imagine, you, you know, the worst things you can imagine where people yeah. come out of. Have you ever seen anyone in all of your years who, if they stayed in the fight, God didn't show up for them where they weren't healed or where they mm -hmm. where they couldn't be healed? Mm -hmm. Oh no, I've never seen that. I, I think that's the beauty of the the quality of the openness of our heart that we we keep going mm -hmm. and we keep going with Jesus, and that's very true. And the Lord, you know, and it's our the, our life is so mysterious in many ways. I think when we see God face to face and we look back at our life, there'll be so many mysteries that will finally be revealed. And, and this side, we're just so small. Like Saint Paul says, we see dimly now as in a mirror. We we just don't. But as we just we keep, just keep going, I mean, just getting up and keep going. We fall, we get back up, we keep going, and and that that's that's you know persevering to win the crown. And there's no substitute for that. It's not always romantic, <laughs> but but it's the best. Like, what other option is there? Like, you know, lay down and just I don't know. It's like there's really no other option when you think about it. Like, the only way is through. It's really true. The only way is through. Wow, it's interesting you just said that. The only way is through. Mm -hmm. oh. Fascinating. Yeah, I, don't I don't know, know how should, many times I don't know I if I should that. reveal where that where that original the Holy Spirit originally. It actually came to me in an exorcism hmm. with, with a victim that was uh, had suffered more than anybody I could ever imagine, mm -hmm. and and they so desperately wanted to be healed, but of course in the middle of that process in healing it's so traumatic. Yeah. And I whispered in their ear, "The only way out is through. Mm. The only way is through." So it was fascinating to hear you say that. Mm -hmm. 